Here's a special intuitive message for Monday, July 22nd, 2024. You may be feeling that you're coming into your magic this week. Maybe like things are alchemizing in your everyday life. Maybe even some friendships being rekindled and making some decisions about your life and what you actually want and what you don't want. Also around this might be systems being born in your life i.e. the way that you do things. It might be as simple as having your coffee before you shower, and it might be as complicated as literally figuring out the spiritual system you want to practice long term and maybe even sharing that with others. There has been a lot of activity recently with the collective energy. If you haven't noticed the shifts happening and even some weird timeline things, you might start noticing them a whole lot more going forward. Be very aware of that, even things like the resonance of our planet, and really just be aware of your own thoughts and your feelings and make sure that they are in alignment. If you're feeling uneasy and you're trying to think positively, focus on having yourself feel positively and vice versa. If you have negative thoughts but you're feeling pretty positive and you don't really know why you're having negative thoughts, work on pruning those negative thoughts. This is a time to get in divine alignment so that you can step in as a full star seed volunteer in the next wave of human consciousness. I want to remind everyone that good does not win by default, okay? This is not just a pre-written story. We live in a simulation and in a narrative. And yes, good wins and prevails ultimately in the end game. But it's up to us to actually make decisions and choices to choose the light, to choose knowledge, to choose wisdom, to choose equality over all things. Because if you haven't noticed, it is crazy out there. And in order to avoid this type of scenario where it's us versus them all the time, what we can actually do is choose to take activations within our own lives every single day. If we live the way we're supposed to live, then we can avoid this feeling within us and potentially avoid this in our actual 3D timelines. Now, if you're wondering who the heck I am, my name is Cub. I explore the supernatural every single day. I'm also starting to do intuitive messages like this. If you like this type of thing, comment intuition and be sure and give me a follow. And if you really wanna unlock yourself with me, go check out my Mystery School membership. You will not be disappointed. Peace.